Welcome back to the Real Woman Popular Opinions and today I am starting out a kind of weekly vlog. I liked how the weekend one wasn't that long but I still think I was a little too short. I think like the golden spot is between 20 minutes and 30 for most people at least. So I'm gonna see how long this can go but it is going to run till the end of Thursday and then I'll upload it on Friday because I'm going to a friend's house for the weekend, like Friday to Sunday. So that will not be <laughs> when I can do anything because I see her every couple months. But yeah, I blanked out. I am going on a walk, so you won't really get any updates right now, but I will let you know what I plan to do. I have been reading like the Bungo Stray Dogs light novels because I found a place online when you can read them, I read one and was already sufficiently traumatized by that one but if I find another one I will read it and let you know but physical reading wise I will continue Kenobi during the like after last weekend I got to like page 220 so it's over halfway at this point and I hope to finish this and I will if I just sit down and this is something that I was planning to start but we will see how that goes and that's truth which I I mean by the way this book is <laughs> this edition is gorgeous and it's very floppy but we don't know how I will like it it's been a while since I've been able to stand YA so I'm not sure how this one's gonna go but that being said wish me luck because I really really have have no tolerance for YA so yeah when I'm back from my walk I will read one of these and I will update you Accordingly, I will also buy some candles in a shop, so maybe I'll show you that. But aside from that, this has just been rambly. This is an intro weekly vlog. Hope you enjoy it. It won't be too long, and yeah, let's just have fun together, and please just hope that I like Truth Witch, because otherwise I feel like I'm gonna give up on YA for the moment. As you can see, I am absolutely abysmal at updates, but I am done. <laughs> but I'm just, I just finished it. I didn't update you throughout because frankly I was reading since I got home, so. I, <laughs> the thing with Star Wars book, this books that I already said like in a couple videos, is that they always, if they're not the main plot line, they have a lot of side characters and I don't really generally care about side characters. I care about, obviously, Ben Obi-Wan in this one specifically. So, so I kind of skipped around some of the side stuff. I didn't skip, like, literally didn't read it at all. I just, what's the word? <laughs> skimmed. Yeah, I skimmed, like, to get the gist. And then I'd read when Ben was back. But I loved it. Like, the thing about Georgeverse versus the Disneyverse is that the books just have this air about them. Like, this feeling that just exudes that it was approved by George and his vision. Like this is labeled as legends, as you can see, because Disney said, screw that, we can't deal with the universe, we wanna make our own shit. But <laughs> I absolutely loved it. I loved it because it shows you what Kenobi was up to when he was there, how, how he feels about the past, how much guilt he carries and how he feels about his responsibilities <laughs> and I loved it I literally loved the interaction he had with like the main the other main character and the thing with the Tuscans how it like sort of came full circle I liked it I liked it a lot and I was not gonna give this five stars but I think I am actually gonna give it five stars now because I rate Star Wars books by how much I enjoyed the message and how it relates to the main story not necessarily how great the book is because to be fair if I rated this as a book it would be low because there was a lot of side characters but I don't rate rate it like that I rate it based on how much I liked the main arc that relates to Star Wars my the main point of Star Wars so I think this is gonna be like a 4.6 but basically a full five star on on Goodreads and I'll write up the review but yeah it was <laughs> It was great and if you're a fan I definitely recommend it and I will be moving on with Legends. I have two more books in Legends that I bought and I will definitely be digging through this 
mother load of George stuff because <laughs> because I I don't associate with Disney Star Wars anymore that doesn't exist when George left in 2014 or 2015 that was it so this was great <laughs> it was definitely great five stars and I've talked long enough about it I will talk more in the wrap-up but <sighs> I'm not sure if I'm gonna read more tonight I will let you know if I do tomorrow because now it's like 11 and I'm not really going to be pulling, pulling out this to talk to at like 1am. But yeah, I will let you know tomorrow what I've decided on reading next and if it will actually be Truth Witch. I also wanted to say that I love this bookmark. It has like a ruler, but in general it's one of those like moving bookmarks. I, I love it. So now it's finally available again that I'm done with Kenobi. My hair looks absolutely atrocious today. I have to wash it, but we will ignore this because this is a vlog and we are here in the name of content. I <laughs> I started a weekly vlog last week, as you saw the clips, but then for two days before I had to go to my friend's house for like the whole weekend, I started watching an anime and I could not stop watching the anime for two days. Then I went to my friend's house and then I had a crap week. So now we are starting a weekend vlog in addition to Monday and Tuesday of last week. So this will be a weekend vlog. It is currently Saturday. It is 5.45 in the afternoon. So I will be telling you what I'm reading today, what I'm doing today, and then tomorrow, and hopefully the two clips will be a nice addition to this. So yeah, no weekly vlogs. This is just going to be a weekend vlog plus extras because I am very easily... <laughs> distracted this is why i think these things are really useful for me just like readathons because it forces me to do something in a time period because if i set it for myself it is not getting done just like tbrs there's a reason why i can't stick to tbrs so as you just saw i booted up my computer i am about to the pink wire was for my phone i'm about to transfer stuff for a video and then edit it and after that we are going to read until I have to go on a walk. We are reading The Great Hunt. And since last week, when I finished Kenobi, I read 
all of the silent patient and I think something else right I got the Bungo Stray Dogs light novel one and I completed that in like an evening and I read silent patient in a day if you want to know my thoughts you can go on goodreads I'm not really going to talk about it that much I mean Bungo Stray Dogs we already know that I love it so much so that makes two light novels that I read this month both were five stars at least I didn't cry on this one and Silent Patient, I did not really like it. You can see why in <laughs> on Goodreads. I gave it three stars, I think. I gave it three stars, yeah. And I've established that everything that I've read that has been that genre in book form, I have not enjoyed. So we will continue trying, but it has not been good. Like, it's a read that was very quick and easy to get through, but I got nothing from it absolutely nothing. I felt nothing. <laughs> nothing negative, nothing positive. I just did not enjoy it and wasn't satisfied in the least. Check out my Goodreads because I don't really want to talk about it that much. I feel like that ship has sailed because I read it right before I had to go to my friend's house so now I don't have any thoughts about it anymore. I read it last week or on Monday. Maybe on Monday. Maybe it wasn't even last week and I have no thoughts about it anymore so check that out on Goodreads but right now we are reading Great Hunt and I think I'm going to start out something else because Great Hunt is a chunker you can't read that really in a day I mean you can but I read it already so I won't I will start something else too this is my food and this is an intruder <laughs> I'm pretty sure he is eyeing the food but he is not getting shit <laughs> you are a menace you know that a literal menace yeah, I mean you. You're not getting my food. Hello. Me again. I am apparently a failure at consistent vlogs. We will do our best to repair this in September because there are readathons in September and that should make me sort of accountable <laughs> but until then as you can hear it's rain day I mean I didn't fail that much it's Monday and I will wrap it up today but it won't be a long vlog again because I am trash I am apparently trash I was supposed to vlog yesterday but it was a shitty day and then we spent like the entire evening watching Prime Suspect. <laughs> so, yeah, anyway, watch that show. It's great. But aside from that, I am a failure. At least it's gloomy and raining. It's gorgeous. I'm about to go to the, go to the store because I'm going to make chocolate chip cookies and then watch The Witcher Nightmare of the Wolf, which came out today. And like it's Castlevania voice actors sort of looks like Castlevania. And it's The Witcher. It's about Vesemir. So... It's exactly up my alley and we will be watching it. I will get some clips of the cookies. I'll do my best and when I start watching and then I will edit and this will probably go up tomorrow because or maybe I'll just leave it to upload while I'm watching The Witcher. Anyway, besides the point, what did I read? We continued The Great Hunt. I did not read much or <laughs> like that much. <laughs> But this, these are chunky books, so I was never gonna like read this this weekend. I'm gonna read like one book a month. That was at least the plan, which means that when that terror of a show comes out, I'm gonna be at like book four, five maybe. But yeah, like I love how floppy these hardcovers are. Like it's hard to show, but like when it's that loose type of hardcover, it is my favorite. <laughs> So yeah, we read a couple chapters, but again, it's it's large. And aside from that, I picked up 39 clues because I was rearranging my bookshelf to make space for the exciting manga that's coming, which I will hopefully unbox when it gets here. But I started 39 clues because I was like, I didn't read it in a while and I really enjoyed it when I was a kid so I wanted to try it out again because they travel all over the world and that's always been fascinating to me almost completed this like have maybe 50 pages left so I'll probably finish that today 
And that's kind of it for the vlog. I was gonna read the Dumpier comic, but <laughs> I was just not in the mood. So, this has been a chaos of about two weeks. I hope you found it sort of enjoyable. I will not talk to you anymore. I will just put in some clips of the cookies and of me watching the witcher and maybe i'll like put in some clips of the weather because it's wonderfully gloomy and if you're a book nerd you probably thrive in the rain just like me so that's pretty much it let's hope that next time gets better and then in september i will be consistent because i'm doing both the magical readathon and there's another one that i found but i forgot the name of but i will be doing the magical readathon and hopefully hopefully i will be productive at least a little before i go back to university so this is the update. Let's hope you're not <laughs> too bored and you can shame me if you want because I am ashamed. <laughs> I always give myself tasks and I don't do them. Even though I have to-do lists and planners and bullet journals and Notion and whatever else. But in my defense, I am still on holiday. So <laughs> enjoy the rest of the clips and I will see you in the next video. Here we go, it's time. Krene s pjesmom, i sve ja ne mogu.
Aj, dobro, sam sva prijatelja. Baš da vidimo poste. Pazi ima čičke gore. Ok, evo da postavim još vidimo. 